Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the vlog channel. Right now, I'm actually filming for my main channel. I had a video shoot for my back to school videos. So, over here, guys, vlog warning in three, two, one. This is Ruben. He's my camera guy and my videographer, the magic behind my main channel videos. And this is my best friend Skylar who also assists me on my shoots and stuff because we have how many outfits today like 12 something like something that. like that so I I can't keep track of all that so <laughs> luckily she helps me out with all of that right now we are at the university and we are filming some dress code life hacks this video probably won't be going up for like a week or so but the vlog fam you guys get you guys get a little sneak peek change I am now in a different outfit for a different hack but while I wait to change into the next one I wanted to give you guys a little bit more information on like what's going on with the house today because I know yesterday's vlog was a little weird because like the whole first half of the vlog the whole first like three quarters of the vlog were like we're not getting the house today da 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 and then all of a sudden it's like it's ours we're homeowners so everything was finalized last night and then today is gonna be our first day that we actually like go over there and you know live in our house for a little bit. We're not actually gonna move in until Sunday, July 22nd, but to celebrate us getting the house tonight, we're gonna go over there with an air mattress and sleep in the living room. And we're also gonna bring the dogs. So the dogs are gonna get to see the house for the first time, which I'm like weirdly, really, really, really excited about for some reason, just like them seeing the yard and running around the house. I am so excited for that tonight. We also packed a few more boxes that we're gonna bring over. And I think Skylar might come with me after the shoot so that she can see the house because she hasn't seen it yet. And it's kind of on her way home anyway. So yeah, lots going on today. I'm gonna be filming until like 8 p.m. and then run over to the house, pick up the dogs, I mean run over to the apartment, pick up the dogs, and then go to our new house. But until then, it's only like three o'clock right now, I've got about five more hours of filming. So montage it up, let's go. at location number two. This is another video, another secret project coming up soon. I'm doing a video about how to style bodysuits. So we're doing four different bodysuit outfits. We're on number two. How are we doing guys? We're actually way ahead of schedule. We're like two hours ahead two of schedule. Hours. This has been the easiest. It's over. So good. Yeah, so we don't have to worry about the sun. Yeah. Ruben's been killing it. Skylar's been killing it. I mean, I've been killing it. We had a nice <laughs> sushi break. Yeah, it was great. Mame. It was great. So now, we gotta get back into these bodysuits. Okay, so Skylar and I just loaded up both of our cars with boxes and lamps and even our little convection oven. Everything is loaded up and we are about to put the dogs in the car and Skylar is gonna come over and see the house for the first time. The dogs are gonna see the house for the first time. It's like 7.50 right now at sunset. Can't wait to not be in an apartment so they don't bark like this all the time. The dogs do not have a lot of room in the front seat because they have a lamp back there. But you guys ready to go see your new house? You ready? You have no idea what's happening, do you? But you're gonna go see your new backyard right now. And your daddy's there. He's just waiting for you. He's waiting for you guys. It is eight o'clock on the dot. We are just about to drive over to the house. Skylar's in her car, I'm in my car. I just gave her the address and we are gonna head over there. I am so excited for Skylar to see it. I'm excited for these little guys to see it. And we're spending our first night ever in the house, which it's gonna be really fun. I hope there's still a little bit of light when we get there. Steven's been working all afternoon. He left work at like four to go do some repairs on the house. We have a big list of little things that need to be done before we move in. Nothing really major except for the wall that we're knocking down, but that's not gonna be done until next week. So this week, just a lot of little repairs he's doing. And we're gonna go, go head over there. You ready? Oh my gosh. Loading up my car with boxes made me like weirdly emotional. Like knowing this stuff in my car, is never coming back to this apartment. Let's go. What's this place, guys? What's this place? You've never seen this before, have you? We just pulled up to the house. Skylar is right behind me, but I'm gonna wait to get out of the car until Steven gets here. He ran over to Home Depot. He said he's like five minutes away. So we only have a teeny bit more light. Steven, you need to hurry. I want the dogs to see the yard, and I wanna see the dogs see the yard. Can't really be upset about that considering he's literally at Home Depot getting stuff for the house that he's been working on all day. So very thankful to have him working on all of that. And seeing her little tail wag makes me so happy. What is this new place, guys? Yeah, you can pee on that tree bruiser. That's your tree. Go ahead. You guys ready? Your daddy just pulled up. Come on. Come on. 
<laughs> Let's go see him. Hello. How are you? Good job. All right. You ready to show these guys the house? They peed on all the trees out front. Wait, wait, wait. They don't need their leashes. We can take them off in the house. Okay. You guys ready? Come on, Bruiser. Go ahead. Oh, it's awfully dark. What do you think, guys? They literally ran straight through that door into the backyard. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's go see the big part of the yard. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Look at that. Come on, let's go in the grass. <gasps> Look at the grass. <laughs> we don't have much light in here. Hun, is there any lights that we can turn on here? Uh, this, yeah, I did. It's in the car, though. You want to go grab it? <laughs> you guys like it? Do you like it? We worked very hard to get this house all for you. It's not for us at all. Just for you. Aw, you put our wedding photo out. Yeah, I got a necessity. A necessity in any nice home. <laughs> Oh, I brought their food, by the way. Did you bring any of the dishes? Yeah, I brought all the dishes. The ones that you packed. Look at Bella! Can you believe it? This is all yours. Bruiser, come here. Not yet, sweetie pie. We're not going upstairs yet. We're gonna start with the downstairs, and then later, maybe tomorrow, or the next day, or the next day, you can see upstairs. Chihuahua proof, officially. <laughs> Bruiser trying to see over. All right, Steven is still working on his lock. The dogs have thoroughly explored at least the bottom level of the house. Top half will come later. And Skylar, Skylar got here and she got a tour of the house. What do you think? I'm so emotional. <laughs> <laughs> I am just so happy. I remember when we moved you into your first little teeny apartment. You have moved me into all three of mm -hmm. the places that I've lived as an adult. My first apartment that you guys, if you've been around for long enough, have seen. Mm -hmm. The apartment we live in now and now our first house. Yeah. I remember we like sat there and it was like so empty. I was like, you have your own place. <laughs> and we're like, ah! And now you have your own house. This yeah. is like, 10 times the size of your okay. first apartment. My first apartment was about the size of the kitchen to maybe where I'm standing right now. Oh, for sure. <sighs> It's so exciting. I'm well, so happy for you guys. Thank you. Thank you for helping me with all of this. Of and course. Skylar is actually going to come over next weekend when we do our big move day. Mm -hmm. And her and Kyle are going to spend the night with us for our last night in the apartment ever. It's going to be the four of us, which is going to be really, really fun. Mm -hmm. How's it going? Steven's doing a little dance over there. I finished my lock. <laughs> you did? Yay. Let's forgot the default code still, but look at that. That's Sorted fine. out right away. All right, well, have a safe drive back. I love you. Thank you. Thanks. Mm -hmm. This is weird. This is my first first time like staying in this house. Oh, that's right. So, how was your first day in the house? It was good. It was, you know, so I'm in the work mode right now. So, it's hot and sweaty, but I'm having fun with it. I got a little tiny paper cut on my finger that really hurts. But I have a lot of cool projects I want to do, and I'm really excited to do them. Just gonna be tired and draining. That's the problem. So I'm not gonna be like. Woo! Are you impressed? I'm, I'm really excited inside, but I'm like tired. <laughs> Are you impressed with how much stuff Skylar and I brought over? Because we actually brought a lot. Yeah. Our, both of our cars were like basically full. And we brought the record player so we can enjoy some nice music tonight since we don't have Wi-Fi here yet. I brought the dog's bed. I brought their food, which they are happily enjoying now. Seeing them run into the yard made me so happy. I know. They're that was fun. I was like so tired when you got here. I know. I worked for like three hours. I was like, babe, look, they're so, they're having so much fun. And you're like, I was like, uh, but now you can be excited. Yeah, on my mind I have just like everything we need to do and I'm like. Oops. Well, I have something for you to help fix that. Da da da, into our fridge. What is it? Oh. It's a pineapple palisades. That was your beer that you had there. Do you like that? My beer. Whose beer is it? And it's really old. This is. <laughs> I'm sure the thought was nice. <laughs> All right, fine. How about this? Yeah. There we go. You want a Pinot Grigio? Let's pop this open. Do we have, oh, we have cups, right? We brought some cups? I brought coffee cups. Ooh, perfect. Wine and coffee cups. Ooh, actually. What? <gasps> oh, I know what this is. The day we got married and the day 
first in our new house. Oh, these are our toasting glasses from the wedding. Yeah, we be careful. We haven't used these since the wedding either because no. they're like a special occasions thing. This is so cute. Relatively clean. Well, we can rinse them. At home, let's try to raise the temperature up. To get used to not having AC? Well, I mean like, and I want to get some good fans. <coughs> mm -hmm. I'm excited. I brought our camping chairs so we could sit outside and enjoy the yard. Let's go. Come on, dogs. We've got our lovely camping chairs over here, and we can sit and enjoy our Pinot Grigio. Thank you. Oh yeah, so as soon as I got here, I came to water the lawn, and I like turn it on, and I'm like, <laughs> nothing's happening, what's going on? And I was like, oh no, is the water off? I turned on the faucet, no water, and I was like, no! Yeah, so the water's off right now, but I brought over three of our emergency water gallon jugs. So we'll be able to use that to like flush the toilet and brush our teeth. But other than that, we're not gonna have water. We won't be showering tomorrow morning here, but the water should be turned on tomorrow. So, and we have power. Hmm, this is like, this is like my actual goals right here. All right, the air mattress is blowing up. That's where we're gonna be sleeping tonight. Steven finally finished the lock on the front door. He said he finished it earlier, but he, he wanted to fix the code, so it was a personal code. And I ordered a pizza, which if you guys know me, I don't really like pizza, but I thought that sounded, I don't know, I thought that sounded kind of fun. Bridger, are you getting on the air mattress? Are you getting in trouble with your daddy? Real quick here, it'll be a miracle if that thing blows up. I don't think that battery's gonna last. Well, if it doesn't last, maybe we won't be sleeping here tonight, but I'm still pretty, Pretty committed to it working. I think it'll happen. Look at that, the air mattress worked out after all, and what just got delivered? Our high grade pizza. Woohoo! Pizza, air mattress, I'm ready. And upon Steven's advice, we brought over a few plates, not all of our stuff, but yeah, that was really smart. I wouldn't have thought of that. All right, hit me with two slices. Two slices. I call this the new house special. Oh, thank you. Yes, ma'am. All right, I am working on the second of four locks. There's Sierra. We'll get to we'll get to her in a second. So that was one lock. That's done. And technically, I'm going to replace that handle. This needs to be replaced. I'm working on this one, and then I'm going to redo that one. And just like a real quick rundown on what was going on with the locks. Um, they're really cheap locks, and and the keys really suck. I'm sure we could rekey those. Uh, we got some quotes. They're pretty expensive. So it's either we get the key locks rekeyed and hopefully the locks would improve in quality because maybe just the keen was done poorly. And for 30 bucks more, so it's like $130, I just got new locks for everywhere. And I'm much happier. And plus it's like a little fun project to do. But anyways, let's check in on Sierra. Here's Sierra hanging out while I work. I keep like tearing up. Like I look around and I'm like, this isn't ours. <laughs> no, this is like I an Airbnb. Know. This is a hotel. And then I'm like, we own this. Bella, yeah. this is your house. Tomorrow morning, yeah. you get to run out there and pee. We own it because the mortgage went through, and oh my gosh, we have a mortgage now. No! <laughs> In debt forever! Yay! Yes. <laughs> what is it, 30 years? 30 years. 30 man. years for debt? <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, that loan process was very exciting. Uh, not. So I'm laying on the air mattress with my sweet little puppies cuddling me while Steven works hard on these locks. I offered to help, but he was like, you know what, just take the couple things that you had to take upstairs up there and then relax. So I did that, organized things a little bit, took out some trash, and now I'm just hanging out and looking around and I wish I could say, oh my gosh, it just hit me, but it didn't. It still hasn't hit me. When I say it doesn't feel real, I literally mean that. Like, I thought that being here and sleeping here and having the keys and everything would make it feel real, but I I feel like I still don't really believe it because we only had a 30 day escrow, so the whole process went pretty fast. Typically, I think escrow is anywhere from 30, 60, 90, or 120 days, so we were on the very, very short end of that. So the whole process just moved pretty quickly, and there were a lot of times where we thought this wasn't gonna work out. We found out there was an AC. We found out that we thought there was gonna be a Melarus, which turned out not to be true. We thought the solar power wasn't gonna be owned, which also turned out not to be true. It is owned. There were just a lot of little things along the way where we were like, I don't know, maybe this isn't gonna work out. Like the bank appraisal, we're like, if that doesn't match up, we're backing out. But it all fell into place somehow in that 30 days of escrow. And now here I am laying on an air mattress in my living room, 
with my dogs and my husband working on the locks. I am so happy and I am just really really enjoying reflecting on this and sitting in my living room and realizing that this is going to be a house where a lot of big things in our lives happen and today is just the start of all those big things this is the first big thing and man like I, I keep thinking about like oh I'll make a scrapbook page for this day in our yearly scrapbook and like oh where are we gonna put the cups like I was putting some cups away I'm like Choosing which cupboard our cups and our silverware are gonna be in which sounds so like trivial But for some reason all those little things make it feel more and more real But I don't know if it'll really feel real until the day that we move all our furniture in because right now I'm still chilling on this air mattress, but I'm gonna put the vlog down cuddle the dogs hopefully cuddle Steven when he finishes this up and uh, I guess we will check in with you guys tomorrow morning Bella sweetie. What do you think of the new house? Do you like it? Do you like your yard? Do you like the trees? Good morning in our new house. <laughs> yes. We just had our first successful sleepover in the new house. Air mattress was tiny, but somehow it wasn't terrible. We'll see how my neck feels later today. Um, in typical Steven Sierra fashion, the house is already getting a little messy. <laughs> we have like 10 things in here and it's all over there. I think we're gonna get ready to walk the dogs. And by walk, I mean open the door and let them run around the yard. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to walk them. All right, let's, let's showcase the abilities of this wonderful door. Oh, so now, just FYI, so in the mornings I would have to leash them up and then I like going one at a time because it's less stressful. So now I'm just gonna open the door and they're gonna run out, pee and poo. Which I need to get a poop scooper. Or a pooper scooper, what do you call them? Let's go. work about maybe 45 minutes ago now I had a few things to do on my phone I had to call the city to set up water and trash and get all the boxes unpacked Skylar and I actually brought a lot of stuff over last night which is great the plan is for the next two weeks before we move in every single time we come over we're gonna try to fill up our cars with stuff so that by the time that we actually have our big moving day with the moving truck we're mostly just doing furniture so that's the plan, but we'll see if it actually ends up happening. We are gonna be coming back here again later tonight. My brothers are gonna come see the house for the first time and we're gonna bring more boxes. <laughs> but this is where I'm gonna end today's vlog. I'm about to head out. I have some more filming to do today. Yesterday I filmed all of like the B-roll. So like the, the fancy clips that lay over the footage of me talking. And today I need to film the talking parts. So that's what I'm pretty much gonna be spending my whole day doing. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and our first night in the new house you'll be seeing a lot of this place for the next I don't know however long our vlog channel goes for or however long we live here so thank you for watching and I'll see you next time bye